Hey guys, welcome to Ocean at Matan, which is actually cool because we have news for you. We just opened a new location and we're excited to show you. So come with us. <laughs> at the beginning of next year, the construction of the co-working space and the offices will be finished and we'll be excited to welcome brand new startups that are working on hard tech. But at the moment, you can already find some companies there in Matan. For example, we have Geffa Tech that's developing 3D printing technology for metal. And we have Light and Fog, which was the first startup to move to Matan, which was last year in June. Light and Fog. And we caught up with them and they showed us around their space. Oh, well, actually, this is my first time seeing this. It's very fascinating. Welcome here at Light and Fog. Um, I would say I will just show you around for the first time. Yeah. This is our uh, workspace for mainly engineers and horticulture and software development. To an introduction, Light and Fog does vertical farming. Mm -hmm. So we basically create modules that uh, grow plants like in a 3D printer. Like uh, it's you click on a button and it comes out whatever you want. And um, what you can see here, um, there's a little lab space. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's uh, closed for today, but <laughs> um, the kitchen and uh, our first module M, which is basically um, the essence of what we're doing. So basically this is our test stand where we tested for the real uh, scaling up later on mm -hmm. and where we can see how actually we can grow the plants and what climate they grow best, how, what they like most and how we can actually uh, proceed to, to, to build a bigger module. And there's a little catch to what we do um, on because we grow on textiles and with fog and therefore the name light and fog. It's lightweight, it uh, uses light, so there's a little wordplay, and we grow with fog and that gives us the ability to grow plants without soil, without pesticides, with 95% less water and with very little uh, capital investment, let's say. Uh, so it's really efficient and it can give you the most tasty plants whenever you want them and wherever you want them. What's the next step for you? Also wir sind wirklich die Einzigen, die das mit Nebel machen. Und äh, der Nebel war am Anfang eine Idee, dass man das einfach, dass die Pflanzen besser wachsen. So for us, this is basically close to deep tech in a way that it's very necessary in the future. It's very useful today. Um, but we don't see any point of uh, going along with the conventional agriculture and the way we do it today. Mm -hmm. So this is why we were looking for a space that is high-tech, that has some place and um, where we can grow in an environment, let's say, in an ecosystem that is full of thinkers, makers and uh, engaged people. Well, for us, for example, one thing was very important, it's that it can be heated during the winter. This is the first thing, um, that it is not too big because we're still a startup. That doesn't mean that uh, we need a bit more than just three cables and laptops because it's not about software, but we need something that is uh, hands-on for it. We were looking for this space that is also presentable in a way mm. because our investment is not that we send you uh, basically a software or try it out or there's a simple concept but you actually have to see and feel it. Uh, it's, it's a much more, um, it's basically also a presentation place and it served well because we got along well and uh, we had lots of invites and everybody was coming here with this surrounding, the setting and then the little machine that works pretty well for us to, to have a, um, like to, to create a vision in, yeah. uh, in those people coming here. That's really cool and a great compliment. Thank you for that. <laughs> and I wouldn't call it a little machine, but uh, yeah, it looks quite impressive. Other than that, we have sheep yeah. in front of the door. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. And we have space to grow potentially. Mm. Um, never know. Um, maybe in five years there will be another hall with our name on it, yeah. but uh, that's an option and that's good. That's a cool vision. Yeah. Did you feed the basil plants already to the sheep and did they have a... I tried to, but <laughs> apparently they don't... They don't like, like it? Okay. 